what's up my peep yo 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 it's boricua seven did i get it right seven is that like this gangster seven anyway i'm back again showing you guys another unboxing of something else that i just purchased because i don't get no stuff mailed to me like those other lucky youtubers uh no nah, at least not yet i just started this stuff but anyway um let me stop whining and crying uh, I just came on to show you my new uh, gadget that I got for uh, my um, GoPro for silver which I purchased a while ago also and I'm gonna be taking it on a, you gotta watch this later on I'm gonna be taking a uh, fishing trip so with my son and my wife so and his girlfriend so uh, we're gonna see how that goes because I never used that before I'm gonna use it for the first time and anyhow anywho here's the box where it came in I'll put the uh, links on the bottom later on where I purchased it from so you can go check it out um, here we got the box open and what we got is this and this comes out of it and then the box that's it nothing else they don't put nothing really um, strong to protect this but anyway here it is it's called the Polar Pro Grip, the Power Grip H2O. The Power Grip H2O. See, as you can see there, I don't know if it's focusing because I cannot see, but I hope you guys can get it. This is the back of it. You can put this on the water, which is the coolest, and you could charge for 12 hours. The battery lasts 12 hours, so you could charge your uh gopro for the 12 hours you can um charge your cell phone while you're out there which is great you know sometimes you can't find an outlet especially when you finish fishing um you can also charge your headphones you connect your headphones with a usb and uh it's pretty cool i think not only on oh, your headphones you can charge your headphones too i don't know if you see that you charge your headphones and it extends from 11 inches to it has an extension of 22 inches to 33 and is original is 8, 11 inches it's the um, the main the main uh, portion of it is 11 inches that you can extend it to 22 33 uh, uh, inches long with the other adapters so anyway let's get into the opening of it so here we go I'm gonna take this tape off I think I already cut it Bear with me as I, uh, last time I broke the whole damn box trying to open this darn thing. Hope you guys can see it, but I don't have no other table, just this little table here. Okay, what we got in the box, that's it. The box is out. And then you got what comes in the box. Let's go little by little. You get your cable. That's uh, let me see, let me not break this, because I might, in case it's me, you gotta keep the stuff uh, pretty cool until you figure out if it works, in case you gotta send it back, but sometimes you can't open it, so you gotta do what you gotta do, you know, you gotta break it open. Anyway, this one, like this one, see, broke open. So, you got your cable for, to charge your, you have to charge this, obviously, because you have to charge this in order to work. Your USB cable with a small pin cable to charge it. You got another USB cable, which I'll figure out which one is this for. I think it's this one to charge. And then you got another, another. Uh, you got a strap. So you can strap it so you don't drop it or lose it on the water, I guess. And another USB cable. So that's a total of three. You got one, two, three. I don't know if that's a. Oh, that's two, two, two. So if you have to charge two things. And this is probably to charge the device itself. You got the instructions, which we hardly never read unless it gets critical. You got the, uh, the little door. This is for when you're gonna charge the device, but you cannot charge the device underwater. I mean, that's a silly, you know what I mean? But there is a way of connecting this. And, this, and uh, there's another thing they sell separately. We'll get into that later on, to be able to charge it underwater. Anyway. So the, here you got the other the little, um, what they call these? Um, the little plugs for 
the, to the extension to the extension to make it longer and obviously to put the camera you got to do one extension you got one two extensions I don't make it 33 inches obviously with the other piece the other piece makes it a total of 33 inches long which is right here this is the main piece as you can see you got one two SB uh, to say channel two SB ports and you got the charging station you got the turn on button so we got to open the door I think you open it like this and then you open the door just because this got to be tight if it's going to go in the water but there's another plug which I'll get into later on and you open it up one two things you're going to charge and obviously you're going to put your thing to to run you have to plug it into one of these then you'll have one available so here you have the another I guess no I guess you charge it here and this is where you turn it on you got to press this a total of three times one two three and I guess it has a little charge we have to charge it completely it's not it takes like three or four hours to get it completely charged but in any event it's it's waterproof you always got to remember that if you go into the water if you get sand or any dirt particles around here around the rubber you got to make sure and in here you got to make sure you get the sand and the dirt out because if this gets pinched by anything, and hair also, even hair, even though it's thin, you got to make sure because if that gets pinched in there, then what's going to happen is that water is going to leak and it's going to damage your unit. And this costs about a hundred bucks without the you know rebates or whatever that like I got and stuff. But in any event, this is it. Here you have a plug. I mean, uh, uh, another way to screw things in. Then you have another extension to put the camera on top. If you want to just screw the antenna. You have another one here. That should be like a buckle to put it on a buckle or something. I'll, I'll get more into it because I just got, hold on. Now this is to hold uh, the cell phone. Let's say, oh, you can record with the cell phone also. You plug it up here. You put your cell phone with one of these things that came in here. And you, you can put it up. And you could put your cell phone and if you want to put it higher you put the extension you go with one whatever as high as you want to put it so you're going to go this high let me put one up so you see how it comes out let me put this one up just give me one second let me try to bear with me i'm going to try to hook it up so you guys get a good, good visual of what it looks like that's the idea right it's not just to look at it halfway it's to look at the whole thing see how it looks and if it's a cool enough product to buy i think it's cool because uh, I think I've got it, I don't know if I got it backwards or not. Uh, yep, I think I got it backwards. It goes, it doesn't say how it goes, but I think it goes this way. Let's see, yeah. Because you got to be able to put the wire so it don't be in the way. It has a little setting here for the wire. As I'll show you in a second, once I get this cock of anything in here. Okay, there goes one, right? So that'll make it 22 inches, I believe. Yep. Then you put the other one on. You gotta get another one of these. Uh, uh, I forgot what they call these things. Uh, it's like a screw thingy. With a metal piece to screw it in. You get the other piece. Let's say you want this piece on. You put it on. That's so. Do I have it right? Let's see. Here, yeah, because that has another piece. Yep. This goes here find the hole which I always have a problem finding the hole that is and you put it in here tighten it up as good as you want so it don't move back and forth okay not too tight but as tight as you need it in case it's windy or whatever but you can I don't think you should go with this on the water just the 11 inch piece then you take your other piece that I showed you earlier this one you hook it up here all right and then you get your uh, the other remaining piece and it comes with two little screws, which I'll find out what those two little screws are for, eventually. And uh, you screw that in here, right? Once you got that screwed in, you put your, uh, tag. where I left my cell phone, I can't reach it right now. It's all the way over there, see? Yeah, anyway, you get the idea. You take the, you could bend this, you can even bend it this way, you can bend it that way, whatever way you want to bend it. To get your shot, like you get like this. You want to get a walking shot? Just turn the camera around and put it on. But you got the idea. The cell phone goes in here. I think you can even put a little camera if it fits in here. I think this extends. Yeah, it does extend. You see? You can put even a little camera up in here. Um, 
I found out what this piece is for, which comes with two little screws. Um, where's the two little screws at? Okay, where's the two little screws? They're probably in here somewhere, I gotta find. Anyway, two little screws go in here. They go back here, one, two. What you do is, you put this in here like that, you put the screws in here, and then you have to get a, a device that, the device that you hold on the chest, this didn't come with it, you put it right in there, okay? And let me make a correction. I said earlier that this, this charger, this will last 12 hours. I didn't mean to say that you can charge your phone for 12 hours. I mean, your, your phone or your camera. Your camera, you charge it to its charge. But I'm just saying that the charger, once you plug it in, and this, another thing I'm gonna tell you in a second, the charger will keep your camera running for as much as 12 hours if you obviously if you don't charge other things with it but you charge it once it's charged you keep it and it continues keep keeps it charge running running to 12 hours after the 12 hours it's gone you got no more you got to recharge this all over again in order to have power but in the meantime if you just got to take a couple of shots like let's say either pictures or you're taking a video that's four or five hours or let's say for argument sake eight hours so you got enough charge in there left I believe to charge you charge your phone you can put your phone there or you can use your phone to do videos also like I said earlier or you could charge uh, your headphones or somebody else's stuff they'll need to do your wife's stuff your girlfriend your mistress I don't know whatever uh, so anyway another thing they don't tell you once I ordered which I got very upset is that I just found out I called them up as soon as I got it the, 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 even on the video they don't show it and the paperwork they give you is baloney there's no pictures, it's all this, so you get it. It's how to use this thing, but it has no pictures showing you anything. The other pamphlet that comes doesn't show you nothing either, as you can see. And the third pamphlet is this one, which is to buy more stuff. To order stuff that ain't in, that's not even the things that are missing is in here. It's to buy more stuff with, uh, with this company or GoPro or whatever. Anyway, what I'm trying to say is that this case here, this you could put under water. Which obviously you can't charge it because there's another piece that goes in here. You have to buy it separately. It looks something like this, but it has two connectors so that the wire could come out through here and plug plug the wire could plug in here with another plug that's waterproof so the water don't get through the plugs. In any event, the other thing I wanted to tell you was that if you wanted to record while it's charging, there's a part that they didn't mention that doesn't come with this. And I don't have it either. I gotta order it. Now. I have to order it today. So the other part is See, if you want to record with your GoPro, but you can't, and to plug it in here, to plug this with your wire that comes with the wire, to plug this wire, let's say, let's say this is not the wire, but the other one over there. You want to plug this wire into your charger to make, to maintain it running while you're charging so it don't go dead. It didn't come with it. It's a, it's a, it's a square case that goes here. It's like, it looks like a picture frame, but it's the size it is obviously and it has two little holes so you can plug the wires here and it has also a hole on the top so that the sound could come out better so and the button here so you can press on and on record and on record so that didn't come with it i just checked it up it's going to be on the link i got it from amazon for about uh eight dollars and 22 cents i believe so now it's gonna take a while. Thank God I have nothing to do that I needed that part right now. But I need it for next week when I go fishing. And I'm gonna bring you that video too. And, uh, upload that also. So it's just, warm, just be warned that that part doesn't come. Now you can still record like this, but, but the battery, you can't connect it, obviously. When it runs out, you would have to take it and plug it, and plug it back in and charge it with the wire and wait. But you can't record because it's gonna be charging. So anyway, that's all I wanted to tell you. So far, I don't think I've forgotten anything else. But the other piece that I told you about, which I'm not going to find out. Everything, I left everything here. Why is everything disappearing on me? Uh, it was a cell phone part that I had here. Now it's not here. That's not to be found. Maybe it's on the floor. Yeah. Anyway, you know what I'm talking about. It's a cell phone piece. Oh, here it goes. Right here. This piece, I got the cell phone. It goes, you could use it on the cell phone, like I said before. See, you put your cell phone, you put this piece, 
You can extend it. You can rotate it. You can do a uh, on the sh on the floor shot or whatever. Whatever angle you wanna wanna put it, you can put it on top of this, obviously. And you could go over the crowds and the court. It's pretty cool. It's like a extension pole. And I found the name of these things that I was saying earlier, like an idiot I didn't know what they were called. These little things are called thumbnails. Thumbnails. These things that screw onto the cocoa right here. These ones that I couldn't remember earlier. Thumbnails. That's what they call. Okay guys, I think that should wrap it up for today. And I'm gonna be having a video about when I got the GoPro camera. I'm gonna upload that first. When, uh, the unboxing of the uh, GoPro 4 Silver. All right guys, so stay tuned to my channel and if, uh, if you haven't subscribed, please subscribe. And, and put likes on my, on my channel if you like the work and if you learned anything. Or if you have any opinions, uh, whether they good or bad, I don't care. You know, you got to be able to take the good with the bad. That's what I always say. But uh, if you got any opinions, any, any uh, good opinions, anything that I should be doing better, because like I said, I'm new at this, I'm just learning. I would appreciate that you guys send me in your, uh, your feedback. Um, again, this is Boricua7.